What is going on guys, it's Mizan, back here, doing another episode of Clash Royale. But in this episode guys, I'm back on my main account, and today, I have a deck that is great. And plus, I have a legendary deck. That's a good thing as well. Let's go ahead and get on into this episode, and do it. Okay, so this deck contains Giant Archers, Knight, Zap, Ice Golem, the new Ice Golem that I just got, like, two, three weeks ago, um, Spear Gobs, Goblins, and Musketeer. So, um, with this deck, you can do a lot of things. Um, I'm gonna save the, uh, Legendary Chest for about, um, maybe two, three vids in, uh, but I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this replay that I, uh, that I posted two days ago to my clan. Um, yes, I've been using this deck for two days. Uh, it's up against a level nine, and um, I've been asking my clan mates if they wanted to, uh, you know, go up against me, up against the double push deck, and it's just awesome. The double push deck is a pretty good deck, and um, there, there might be a extra video on top of this one, not just this video, but another video um, coming out later on uh, this evening. Um, so make sure you stay tuned. Okay, stay tuned with it um, because I'm staying tuned. And so as you can see, he's gonna come in here. It's eleven now. This deck is legit. Okay, it's legit. It's no joke deck. It's a deck that you can actually trick somebody and be able to win. Okay, it's pretty good. It's pretty good deck. Um. With it being two days old, I see it as a good deck because it's been there for two days. Um, and it's just good. It's just very good. Um, I did drop down in trophies, uh, but then I rose back up in trophies. Um, and it's pretty cool. So, and then I just, like, moments ago I wanted to try the deck out because I lost once. Um, and then, um... It was just bad, so I just forgot it. I was like, no, let's just uh, not deal with that. So, I have a giant. Um, he has an Inferno Dragon. So, I'm like, okay, he's got an Inferno Dragon. I'm going to go ahead and push on that. Uh, you know, I'm going to go ahead and push on both sides um, of the board. But I did. I messed up a little bit, guys. I did. I messed up a little bit. Um... He's bringing everything he has right now on um, that left side, and I didn't take that. But with this deck, you can support and you can uh, make two pushes, and that's what I love about this deck. You can do a lot of things with it um, from time to time when you're using it. So, uh, you know, as you can see, here comes the giant. I have my giant placed, uh, musketeer, uh, goblins, and uh, archers so we're gonna go ahead and do a lot of damage he zapped but it don't take out my goblins um we have spear gods down he has an inferno tower inferno dragon um and uh that push is done on that left side so i'm not really worried about that right side i'm worried about that left side right now um i'm like okay let's go ahead and try to uh you know that inferno tower is gonna do a lot of damage to, uh, that tower if I didn't stop it um, as you can see 199 and uh, we're about to take this uh, tower down on that right side um, we was but uh, he stopped it but we're gonna get that left tower and it's gonna be good and it's just gonna enclose this uh, you know replay and match that we have so level 9 legit um, deck that can do a lot of damage um, and, uh, that's how that is. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, show you guys another replay of it. Um, it's right here. Um, I do have another video, um, coming out Monday, uh, on that vid, on that deck that you guys just saw in, uh, the replay. Um, if you guys were paying attention, that deck, there's going to be a, a deck on that. There's going to be a video on that deck. Because it's pretty good, too. Um, like... I'm not gonna judge a deck um, on just 
using it one day. I'm going to judge it on like using it like three days, two days, even four days. Um, in the past, when I was making all these random decks, um, like I do now, random deck, random deck, all created by me, and it's just, you know, some of these decks are created by other people that I get from Google to try to help you guys, and it's just good, so, um, as you can see right there, we're bringing in, uh, he's got his, uh, you know, he's, he's doing good, you know, he's doing okay, um, alright, uh, as you can see, he's got the giant, and I'm just gonna go ahead and send in more of that, uh, push that I was doing, um, and then here we go. So, we're gonna get a lot of tip damage on that left tower, 819, uh, looks good, this is another level 9, that's why I enjoy this deck so much, because it can beat level 9, uh, when it wants to. Uh, not every single time, but when it wants to, like when you wanna use it effectively, um, you gotta make sure your elixirs most times, like this deck that, this, uh, push that he had going on the left side, I had to use elixir, um, and then I had to reinforce my, um, you know, reinforce my, uh, pushes, but then we're getting a lot of damage on that tower, so 51 hit points on that left tower remaining, uh, that's pretty good, we have a, um, knight, baby dragon goes down, um, and then goblins are coming out, taking out that princess, and we're gonna go ahead and get that left tower, and he's in a hole, he knows it, he knows he's in a hole right now, and he's sending in giant and all grab for the good, uh, so with, with this deck, you know, you got other things that you have, and you got other things, you know, that you have between it, and then, uh, great, um, skeleton army views right there, I guess it's pretty good, I went ahead and uh, almost killed what he had going on there, um, so, as you can see, we have a lot of seconds left, um, for him to at least come back and get that tower, now, what I'm doing now, uh, it looks like he's gonna get the tower, he is gonna get that tower, um, and, uh, we're going into overtime here, um, so, as you can see, here we go, um, Ice Golem going into effect, and we're starting that push on that right side. Now, let's go ahead and drop down the, uh, Muscle 2 to, to support that giant, and, uh, it's just good, so we're doing okay with this, and, uh, we're, we're all good, guys, and, um, if you guys didn't notice, this is a replay. Um, so, we're gonna go ahead and take down that giant, um, and we're doing a lot of damage on that, uh, right tower, we're gonna go ahead and get it down, and we're gonna take it out, and that's gonna be a good game, uh, and a well played good game, mate. Like that. This ends. It's awesome. So guys, uh, if you want to use this deck, go ahead and use it. Um, I gotta do one more, um, I gotta do one more live attack for you guys, because I need to let you guys make sure this deck is good for you, because, you know, to show you guys that it's actually good, to show you guys you can use it, you can do it, you know, you can use this deck in any way. Uh, so let's go ahead and get on to it. So, he's got a witch. Which means we need to conserve elixir in this match. Alright, archers. Uh, zap, coming in hot. Um, goblins, he goes a zap. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, drop a knight. I'm gonna go ahead and shut down his, uh, push. Um, and we're doing bad in elixir, but we took down his, uh, we took down his witch, that's, that's pretty good. He, even though we used all that elixir, we took down his, uh, witch. That, that would have killed our tower almost. Um, so, I'm gonna go ahead and wait until it's 10 elixir, and he's gonna go ahead and witch again, it's fine with me. Um, let's go ahead and drop the giant. We've got a Valkyrie too, that's fine. It's all good. It's all good with your Valkyrie, man. Um, so, let's go ahead, oh man, a graveyard. Alright, so this is my first official time defending up against like a graveyard. Um, I haven't done it in the past, so yeah. So, um, as you can see, let's go ahead and uh, Ice Golem. And we're going to go ahead and take that down, and we're going to go ahead and reinforce this push. Um, I can't get down enough, um, 
a mixer. Now we got those spear gods coming in. He's probably going to drop something right on it. Log, all right. We're still doing okay. We just got to wait for that elixir um, to come in. So let's go ahead and right when he gets in the, not in the way, he gets in the way. All right, let's start this push, guys, um, because we need this push and send it in. All right, now let's go with this, and we're going to reinforce a lot in this push um, to get to that tower. Now, um, he's got a Valkyrie, and we're going to go ahead and zap um, what he's got. So, well played. Um, so, we're getting to that tower. Um, no, we're not. We're not getting to that tower, so we might be going into overtime, um, honestly. So, uh, let's go ahead and drop these, this, um, archers, and we're just gonna try to stay alive here. Um, let's try to stay alive, uh, but, you know, the deck is good. Um, even if it loses once, it's good. It's good. It's very, very good, guys. Um, so, right there, um, I can't drop my goblins in time. It's probably gonna take that tower. Um, good luck. Um, we're going to go ahead and send this in there. We're going to go ahead and send a Zap spell in there. We're going to go ahead and send the Knight in there. Go ahead and send some Spear Gobs in there. Um, so we're taking down this guy, um, hopefully. Um, I'm having to spam a lot right now. Uh, but uh, hopefully he won't get that tower and this won't be a bad, well-played good game. He's going to get that tower because I wasn't focused. Because he has that... He has that uh, effective graveyard, and um, I can't really do much. He shouldn't have laughed, honestly. Um, but uh, I'm gonna do one more because I do not like how that resulted. Uh, and uh, you know, I want to show you guys that this deck is actually legit. Um, and it ain't, you know, a deck that ain't good. You know, it, it, you know, it's a good deck. Okay, it's a good deck. So, as you can see, here comes those minions. We gotta start a push for this ice golem on this left side. Um, I might even push with uh, that right side too. Thanks. We're gonna go ahead and get that musketeer when we, when we, when we so choose it. Um, I say fear gods because we have to hurry up and get that this push on the left side because he sent a fireball. So, um... We're getting a lot of chip damage on that tower. Um, possibly even taking it down. No, I'm not going to take it down. But we got a lot of damage on that tower. Alright, now, archers. Go ahead and drop that ice golem in the back. It's going to do a lot of damage for us. It's going to poison. I'm really worried about that poison whatsoever. He's going to get a lot of damage on that tower, but we're not going to worry about him. Uh, we're going to worry about, you know, possibly making um, a reinforced push here. Um, so, let's save up the elixir because we don't have enough elixir to make a push. Because um, he shut down my uh, musketeer. I knew that was going to happen because he had that uh, skeleton army in the beginning. Uh, so, let's see what we can do. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Um... <clears throat> so which giant archers um, we're going to go ahead and send in this ice golem and then spear gods we're going to go ahead and zap his uh, little thing that he's got there make him get crusty um, well played um, he's going to possibly get my tower before I can get his um, and uh, with that you know bad Thing that he has right there so we're, we're trying guys i'm trying to show you guys this deck but you know there's players you know uh so we're going in right now we're going to try to defend this uh push that he's got going on and uh we're going to try to do a lot of damage right here so let's do some damage and he's going to take that tower not really worried right now um, because we're well played. Um, just giving him a good luck. Because I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sway away from what he has. Okay, I'm not gonna let him beat me. Because this deck is just getting pre presented. 
uh, well played. He's just trying to uh, mock me right now. But I'm not really worried about him uh, right now. So let's go ahead and uh, drop down the um, goblins in the back. And that honestly should not have been uh, faulted with. Um, but uh, we're in overtime. And it could be um, a tied overtime. I don't know. Um, well played. Uh, we got to give it to him, honestly. I give it to all of my opponents that I go that face me. And, uh, yeah, you got to give it to this guy because he, he actually went out on a limb to try to, you know, three witches. Um, that's actually a lot of elixir right there. Um, so, right there, go ahead and send him this. And he's going to go ahead and do that, so we're going to go ahead and do this. And uh, if, we can, if we can get that tower, really? So guys, this deck is uh, pretty good. Um, you know, he had, it was a draw, we're all good. Uh, good game, well played, and all kinds of good stuff. So, the double push deck. It's an awesome deck. Um, I know I lost um, once and got a draw, but you guys can try this deck out for yourself. I know it's a pretty good deck, so, uh, you know, Let's go ahead and open that uh, legendary chest, shall we? Um, and remember, it has to be a legendary, okay? Because it says that. It says one legendary. One. So we'll have to see which one we get. If it's uh, the Lumberjack, if it's, um, you know, any of them. You know, if it's any in this list, if it's any in this list, if it's any in this list, we're happy. Okay, guys? Any in this list, um, nothing in there. So... Um, let's go ahead and open it and then uh, close this video. So, one legendary guy, guy, seriously, the legendary that I've been waiting for ye almost a, a long, long time, guys. Screenshotted. And guys, I hope that you enjoyed this episode. With that said, I'm going to go ahead and leave it on the close. With the Lava Hound, you know, it's pretty good to get the Lava Hound now. Um, at least we know we have, uh, you know, um, you know, Legendary. We have one Legendary that I tried to get for so, so long. And uh, I even made rants. Not really rants about it. I just complained about this uh, card. And it's just awesome to finally get my first um, Legendary. Um, it's pretty awesome, uh, and, um, we're gonna have to see what the future holds for this card, okay? Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure you stay positive, and make sure you don't let the hate solve every single one of your problems. And I will see you in the next episode. Peace out.